Hi, Jake with Dive Dynamics. Today in the studio, we're gonna be taking a look at our light bar kit for the 2018 and up JL Wrangler. This kit has been designed to bolt on without any extensive modification using only basic hand tools. Total installation time is 20 to 30 minutes. Let's get started. To get started, we're gonna remove eight total plastic rivets using a plastic trim tool, two from the bumper bar itself, and six forward-facing rivets from the bumper cover. With your rivets removed, you can now pull the plastic cover off. Next, we're gonna remove two bolts from the inside of either bumper support. Now from the factory, these are going to be tight, so we recommend breaking them loose with an open-ended 5 8 wrench, and then finish the removal with a 5 8 socket. With the bolts removed, you can then install your Dow Dynamics light bar brackets. You'll simply place the bracket on top of the bumper support and secure it using the bolt we just removed. Now, while we won't be reusing the plastic trim piece we removed earlier, we will be reusing two of the plastic rivets we removed to finalize the installation of your Dio Dynamics light bar bracket. Take the plastic washer that's supplied in your Dio Dynamics bracket kit, slip it over the factory rivet, and install it on the bracket to help secure it. Now you'll repeat the same process on the other side. At this point, if you were to be adding a secondary light bar or wanting to mount your light bar higher, say to clear a winch, you could go ahead and install your bracket add-ons. To do this, you'll go ahead and line up the groove on the extension to the bracket itself and secure it using the included hardware. Go ahead and secure the bracket with a 10 millimeter socket. You'll then repeat the same process on the other side to finish the installation of your bracket extensions. Now we can install our 30 inch Dow Dynamics light bar. Now you're gonna secure it at the very top of the extension. If you were to be installing two light bars, instead of having this second bolt securing the extension, you'd be mounting your primary light bar right here. Now you'll be mounting your light bar using the included hardware from your bracket. And then go ahead and tighten your light bar down using a 10 millimeter socket. With the light bar nice and secure, now we're gonna show you how to run your wiring to the factory auxiliary switches. To get started with the wiring, we're gonna take our included light bar harness and run it down through the engine bay. Now you can run your wiring however you see fit, but this particular harness is for Jeeps that have the included auxiliary switch panel. If your Jeep didn't come with the auxiliary switch panel, we would recommend picking up one of our standard relay harnesses. Now the harness that we'll be using today does include connections for two light bars. If you're only installing one light bar, be sure to take your second connection and zip tie or tuck it away from any moving parts or heat. Now, as we mentioned before, this particular Jeep came with the auxiliary switch panel from the factory. Jeep has included four power wires for this exact purpose, and you'll notice them tucked in behind the battery. Two 10 amp power wires, which are your orange and your blue, and the brown and green are both 40 amp wires. For our purposes today, we're gonna to be using the brown 40 amp wire that's connected to the number one auxiliary switch on the inside. Jeep has also included a factory grounding point for this exact purpose. You'll remove the nut with a 10 millimeter socket, attach your ground wire, and secure it. With your ground secure, we can go ahead and connect your power wire. So we're gonna remove just a small section from the factory wire to gain access. With just a couple millimeters of power wire exposed, you'll go ahead and plug it into your butt end connector and crimp it down. Once your connection's secure, you can go ahead and tuck the rest of your wires back down. With your wiring secure, you can go ahead and test your connection and make sure that everything's working properly before you close everything up. With your light bar now installed, you'll enjoy dramatically increased light output as well as a cool, unique look for your JL Wrangler. For more information on this product and more, visit diodynamics.com or use the dealer locator tool to find a dealer near you. Thanks for watching.